sorry guys if this is a little crooked. I'm having difficulties today. Um, it could be my eyes. They're really bothering me. I'm just worn the heck out. Um, <laughs> Joanne's and the grocery store was just a bit too much. And I'm highly medicated. So uh, please forgive me if this is crooked. Anyway, I wanted to share this Happy Mail. Uh, this cute little envelope. I've covered up the addresses, obviously. This cute little envelope. The snowman came from Anna White. And I will link her below. She sent me some Happy Mail, you guys. So let's take a peek. Of course I opened it because I'm a kid at Christmas. I mean, come on. We all know I'm going to open it. And I squealed when I got this little card because I love this little card. I got to have that stamp. I haven't gotten it yet, but that is one stamp I want. So hoping your Christmas is sweet. And then she just wrote, P, may your joy be full. Merry Christmas. Many blessings to you and your hubs this holiday season. Love, Anna. And look in the inside how she did. Finished it off. Isn't that sweet? And I always love looking at see which stamp she has on the back. And this one says created by Anna White. And I love her stamps. So that was the Christmas card. Absolutely love it. And the background. Oh, it's just gorgeous. I love that background stamp too. Anna, what background stamp is that? Who is it by? Does it say St. Nicholas? Because that's what it looks like. You'll have to tell me. I hope it's not vintage. <laughs> so in here, she sent me a cute little snowman clothespin. Isn't that cute? I'm going to put this somewhere in my room. I haven't decided where yet, but it's going to stay in my room year-round because it's just too cute. I absolutely love this. And then it can go on my little tree during Christmas. It's so cute, and uh, this is really clever. I love those. And then, oh, she had the bag. It was a glassine bag, and she had this stapled around it, and then um, uh, the little clothespin was inside and the card. And then this was wrapped up really cute. It was uh, wrapped up like this. Of course, like I said, I'm a kid and I opened it and then it had this little trim with this button on it and this little tag. And it says 2P from Anna. So I'm going to take the tag off and I'm going to leave this and I'm going to use this on a project. I haven't decided what yet, but I am going to use this because it's just too sweet not to. It's already done for me. And then you guys, here's a cute little paper. Is this Cosmo Cricut? Because it kind of looks like it could be Cosmo Cricut, especially the weight of it. It's really cute. I miss Cosmo Cricut. I de-stashed all of it like a dum-dum. And look, you guys, this sweet little stamp. I told Anna I loved the stamp because it's got the penny stitching, or penny rug stitching as I call it, because I make penny rugs. And penny rugs were traditionally traced pennies. Of different fabrics usually wool and suit fabrics and they were placed on a bigger piece of fabric such as an oval or round and they were stitched in the blanket stitch all the way around and so I told Anna I loved the stamp because of the blanket stitching and I love doing that kind of work it's very soothing to my soul especially when I'm stressed out so in fact I'm working on a couple of projects right now I'm a little behind because they are Christmas related, but I'm still working on them because I love it that much. So this stamp is so cute and I can't wait to use it. I have not touched it since I got it because I wanted to show everybody what you sent me. So thank you, thank you, thank you so much, Anna. I really, really appreciate it. Her package came, I think, the day I got out of the hospital, if I remember right, and it was it was the perfect day. To get a little happy meal because that was a rough week and then I have a package from Kat you guys I got a ginger I got ginger mail look how cute she hand cuts these she hand colors these she added the little peppermint buttons which I just love and I bet you she got those at the her local reuse it shop and the same with the ribbon. She painted little eyes, so cute. And then she put a clothespin on it 
and it says handcrafted by cat 2021 isn't that adorable and if that wasn't enough you guys we were discussing these now i know everybody's seen these and i got one too because i'm spoiled but she told me i said girl how did you get these done so fast she hand stitched these you guys out of old wool coat out of old coat wool in October when she was doing some errands in between errands she was stitching these because she was helping somebody out can you believe that can you stink and believe that I can't believe that and then you guys the festooning this is called um, it's crepe paper and it's festooning Kat, did you cut that by hand or did you buy that at the reuse it shop? Because that is awesome festooning. I've not seen, oh, I put my washi tape on here. Because <laughs> that's the washi tape that, that Vicki sent. Yeah. And then she has this beautiful fuzzy trim, which I used to have some of this. Um, and I got rid of it all, but I still love it. It's got the eyelash trim in it, and then it's got... Um, like a loop design and then she has the very heavy cording which this stuff is very expensive and she has a little candy cane and some um, good quality uh, pine bow and some more back here and she took a um, piece of uh, I think she took a couple of velvet poinsettias and broke them apart and use the leaves to give a little interest behind. Look at that hand stitched face, you guys. And then here's that teeny tiny little rick rack. Can you believe she hand stitched these buggers? And there's little buttons. And there's some more uh, rick rack. And then she's got a couple of cinnamon sticks in here. And it's in a beautiful paper cone. It's very stiff and sturdy. She has a pom pom in the end. And then she has glued a jingle bell so it jingles she has tied a gorgeous bow and I'm telling you guys nobody ties a bow like cat I mean she does it like professional wrappers and then she has a garment pin and a beautiful snowflake charm cat you know I will treasure this forever I absolutely love this and it will always be on my tree thank you so much for including me in the ones that you showed love. I I love you, girl. You know that. You know that. So thank you so much, Kat, for my goodies, and Anna for my goodies. I really do appreciate it. You guys brought me smiles when I really needed them the most, and um, I can't thank you guys enough. So I have maybe one or two more videos, and then I'll call it a night, and I will talk to you guys later. Make a happy memory. Bye.